Hey folks, the Deuceum here, and welcome to another Let's Play of Reyes. Reyes, Reyes, Reyes. Dr. Reyes, Dr. Reyes. Oh, Dr. Reyes. Can I play the piano anymore? Of course you can. Well, I couldn't before, Dr. Zayas, Dr. Zayas. <laughs> oh, man. I can't remember where I park my car most of the time, but I can remember most Simpsons episodes from the 90s, which I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Very selective memory, mostly based around The Simpsons. Troy McClure. I love legitimate theater. Anyways, uh, what am I doing? I'm going to play a new game. I'm going to try to uh, get some more achievements in the 30-minute era and hopefully unlock one of these other eras as well as some more stuff. And I've been reading up online a little bit about what to do and how to get better at the game. And one of the things I've read is to really focus on a few achievements and just shoot for those. So let's see if I can do that, um, and we'll see what happens, hopefully, with some good results. So press any key. All right, chosen people, fishing village, civilized, fiscal military state, aristocracy, chosen people. Okay, so um, I just have to kind of pick, oh, what was that? Post-classical era, finish an era with 600 prosperity. Finish an era with three completed upgrade projects. Uh, finish an era with a village which has 200 prosperity and three more markers. Well, I don't know if I can do all of these, but I can do some of these. Um, so let's start. Maybe I can do post-classical era and specialized economy. Um, so we'll see if I can do this. Let's start game. Um, and I got to remember I can pause if I need to. So first things first, we are going to move you here, move you here. I am going to try to actually expand and build a lot of stuff initially. I want to get a bunch of villages so that I can shoot for uh, 600 prosperity and so forth. So let's do that and on this side we will build a forest and then on this side we will build a swamp and then I'm actually going to just go right ahead and also build a mountain right next to the forest. Then I'll build a mountain on the other side of the swamp. I'm going to use this guy to start uh, planting fish here and I'm hoping to attract, I'm going to fill the ocean with fish and uh, I will see if that will help increase the food here. So this can increase the food of plants. Um, Alright. But also I want to attract villages that will utilize the fish or maybe not, I don't know. I was thinking I want to get that achievement where you get uh, five water tiles that a village uses, but I don't know if that is what I should be shooting for because um, I do want to get other stuff as well. So let's throw down some herbs here. You throw down some fruiting plants there. We got nomads, and they're probably going to settle somewhere. Oh, they settled right there. All right, well, never mind then. I can't put plants there because they put their village right there. Uh, so this might be a good opportunity um, to see if I can get that achievement where uh, it was one of the achievements. It's not one of these. I don't know if it has to be one of these, but one of the achievements was making sure that I have... Cool. They expand into the water. Making sure that I have... Uh, five tiles of uh, water used up so anyways um, let's go build another ocean out this way somewhere hmm okay so if that guy goes there this guy need to go somewhere here so let's just start moving We'll see what happens, interestingly enough. Okay, and these guys are doing their thing, and that is nothing I have to worry about yet. Fishing docks, it is something. Alright, wealth and use, so I need wealth and food. Okay, I can do that. Wealth will come in the form of minerals. So we'll go throw a mineral down over there. Can I put a forest down here? Apparently I cannot. 
because it is not next to okay so we got a swamp village uh, I cannot just put down a forest because it is not next to an ocean but I can space out how big it is so it goes to uh, just to the left there here so that means this guy well that was wait a minute wait a second let's pause it goes to here okay so that means this guy needs to go right there I should be able to put down a forest and I guess the forest and the desert habitat can commingle why not right okay perfect so we can lay down another forest I'm gonna have lots of villages and lots of things going on all right, we've got a swamp village, cool, uh, and they're not right on the water, which is a good thing. Um, all right, so what do they want? They want food and technology, which I can do. Uh, so this, if next to if next to a mineral, good. So let's put down a technology, a tech mineral here. So that'll increase that, and everyone will be happy. And then I will bring this guy back because I need to start laying down some more fish. Put some more plants somewhere so that actually I'm not gonna put plants in the desert I'm just gonna put animals in the desert and we'll figure it out from there um, and I can upgrade this plants technology cool we'll go put some plants eventually into the desert all in good time where's my ocean giant there he is these guys need uh, 15 food and um, 15 technology and I've got the technology part covered and then just the food which we'll do in a little bit so, and I am going to strive for hopefully 600 prosperity uh, if I can make that happen okay so this plant is now producing a crap ton of technology I wonder if I can upgrade this with food as well. No, I cannot. Uh, I can't upgrade the minerals yet. I don't think. Nope. Alrighty. Uh, Alright, so what else are we going to do? We need more food. That is important. Just lay down some more fish. Wait. And it's an empty square. That's mackerel. That's empty. Only mackerel. That's empty. Okay. All the mackerel are happy. And we have the food. We just need more wealth. So you go spread some wealth. And this increases wealth if next to an animal nest. So actually... Maybe what I'll do is put another mineral here and put an animal nest in between. square so that's another animal nest so we're all over this uh, shelter plus 10 wealth if next to an animal nest uh, but I thought I'd put an animal nest there hmm could be wrong uh, free range blueberry within range okay I mean I don't know what I'm doing all right, let's put down some fishes here. Sweet. Lots of fish, lots of food. Everybody's happy. We just need a little bit more wealth. Let's put some exotic animals here. Maybe that will uh, kick things into gear. Okay. And this project is done. So we've got an ambassador. What do I want to unlock is the question. So this is Swamp Village. 
And if I pick this up, I so I won't get anything with this guy. Um, swamp will unlock herb aspect with this. Upgrades an animal with herb aspect to add food. Uh, swamp here will unlock toxic aspect, so it upgrades tech, which I do need for this stuff here. Um, and swamp with this guy will upgrade tech as well for minerals. And okay, and I got a forest person too. Um, but let's do swamp with this so I can upgrade plants and add tech to plants. Oh no, wait a minute. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Let's go grab a swamp ambassador there. And a forest ambassador will unlock, can upgrade plants with fruit aspect. Um, so I can upgrade plants with food. Oh, whoa, 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 wait a minute. Let's pause. Um, so I swamp ambassador unlock plants adds tech, but I can already add tech to plants using the leaf aspect. So, um, maybe... I can add food to animals, which is not a bad thing. I'll take it. And then the forest ambassador here uh, for this guy. Forest will upgrade animals with wealth. Um, if I take this with the sea giant, I can't. So forest with this uh, will upgrade plants with food. And forest with this guy will upgrade minerals with tech. Hmm. I guess it doesn't matter. So they're all kind of similar. So I'll just grab someone. And then I will continue building more nomads, more villages. <clears throat> In just a minute. Alright, so let's go build some animals over here. Meanwhile, these guys are doing all right. <clears throat> Actually, before I, I can build, nope, I cannot build more fish there. And this already has fish, so yep, good. Keep going. Nothing to see here. Build some animals over there. And you can go over here and build some more plants. You can go build another mountain range uh, I don't know if I need another mountain range actually build another ocean here kind of yeah whatever all right doing well prosperity is slowly going up I just need more more stuff more villagers more villages so we've got a desert desert village Right there, we're going to start building some crap. Eventually, you, Mr. Forest Person, need to build some plants over here so we can get another one of those villages. These guys are doing all right. These guys are doing great. They're building a trade post. What do they need? They need lots of wealth. So in order to have lots of wealth, I'm going to move this guy. we got a forest village as well. Move this guy out here, and we'll start building some wealth minerals. And these guys are doing whatever they need to do. <clears throat> Alrighty. All righty. With three complete upgrade projects and 200 prosperity and three war markers, so school challenge, cool. Uh, technology and food, okay. So I put down blueberries, 10 food if next to an apple tree, dandelion, or strawberry. So I can build a strawberry. Uh, what I can do is plant some more fruit plants. Why can't I plant them here? Oh, because stupid village is there. To blueberry or strawberry? So, 10 food if next to the apple, dandelion, or strawberry. Okay, I don't know. Uh, I'm going to throw down another leaf aspect here because I think that upgrades it. It upgrades the tech. 
Uh, and what do they need for the school? They do need tech and they need food. So they've got food covered and I just need more technology. How did I get technology over here? Minerals. Hmm. Well, that's going to be something I need to deal with eventually. Not right now. These guys need wealth. Uh, they need 30 wealth. They've got 10. And can I upgrade animals? Growth aspect plants. I can upgrade these animals. See what happens. Grade them to goats. Goats get food. They can graze on plants. Okay, I don't care. Uh, if minerals within range. So instead, I am going to add a mineral within range of the plant or of the thing of the animal. I think that'll increase the mineral. Actually, this benefits from more minerals next to it. Um, all right, so you go over here. We're gonna make more minerals somewhere. Like over here. <clears throat> Everybody's happy. Okay, so we need more technology. that a little bit. Alright, how do we get more technology in the forest? I don't quite know yet. But everybody's happy. I'll put some more mackerel down. These guys are one, two, three. They're getting there. They're getting into the water. Desert Ambassador, cool. Uh, so if this guy picks up a Desert Ambassador, I can add wealth to minerals, which will help these things. So I think I will do that. And I should probably be reading some of these messages, but, you know. And then there are a lot of words. And I don't know what to do about so many words. Let's go add another thing there. These guys finished? No, they're almost finished. They got the food, I just need the tech. Okie dokie, how do I add tech? I'll have to add some minerals with tech there in a second. Using this guy. one here so I can use symbiosis on either side if I need to. That's my evil plan and I'm gonna come out here and start planting fish for food. So if they expand into the water they will have lots and lots of food. Okay lots of tech. Um, cool. So they will be able to get the school going. We got a university here. Smart people. Okay. How do we get this university? I ask. We need food and lots of it. We need technology and we need wealth. So let's send this guy out here. I can add wealth um, just by hitting the minerals. And I should be able to add other stuff as well. <clears throat> We got a forest ambassador. We will. These guys started another challenge. Okay, forest ambassador. <clears throat> so forest person grabbed the forest ambassador because they're the only one that doesn't have a person yet. Riding them. Um, upgrades plants with fruit aspect adds food. I apologize for not having a lot more commentary. This is uh, this is taking quite a bit of. Um, thought processing to keep kind of playing and making sure I am achieving these goals so unfortunately it makes commenting kind of difficult um, alright so they're doing their thing there what is this doing this needs wealth and it's got wealth 
And he needs 90 food, so I will need to start upping the food somehow. So I'll worry about that soon. Where are you at? Okay, you need to start increasing my mackerel count out here so these guys have more food. Add food. To them using these aspects, which is cool. And looks slightly weird, but hey, you know, say la vie. Um, such is life. Parrotfish. Transmit lesser aspect, lesser uh, parrotfish. Get a small amount of wealth, but their homes provide a boost for wealth and tech depending on diversity. Hmm, interesting. Um, maybe I'll make a parrotfish out here. Wow. I almost don't want to, but let's try it and see what happens. So that knocks everybody down, but it gives quite a good boost in wealth. Wow. And technology. Go parrotfish. Um, alright, so... We'll have to come back to this right now. I want this guy over here and to do something about some of that stuff over there. Uh, these guys are fine. This guy is fine. Looks like one of you is getting quite greedy. Greed is village is more likely to attack the village. That's fine. Uh, <clears throat> in fact, I could probably see using some of these counters. <coughs> it's not these guys. It's not these guys. It's not these guys. It's these guys here. Greedy bastards. That's okay. Um, we'll figure that problem out later. What do I need here for this project? I need food. I need more food. And I need more technology. Alright, well, we can lay down a technology mineral. That's a start. And what's next to mineral? I'll lay down another mineral right next to it in a moment. Um, as far as food goes, let's put some more mackerel and let's start upgrading these mackerels. Holy mackerels! Fifty-eight. I need to get up to sixty. I'm going to need wealth, so I can upgrade these guys with this aspect, get a little bit more wealth from them, cool. Let's throw down more minerals, more wealth, and looks like they, yep, symbiose quite nicely, and some more wealth over here. So these guys, what do they need for wealth? Twenty. I've got 18. Yep, I'll be able to get the wealth and the food and the technology they need, so that should be perfect. So that should complete that project, and now I'm going to use Herb Aspect on all these things. That should really boost the food out here for everybody. Maybe not. Kind of hoping for a bigger boost. There we go. Alright. What does this need? It needs food. So we're getting there. And we need... 90 food. And 50 wealth. So we got the wealth covered, we just need more food. So I can put some food over here, and here, and potentially here. So you go add food to these animals there, and then you... Can I get food out of animals? No, those create wealth. Yeah, I can put domestic animals out here to generate some food. I 
That didn't help. Hmm. All right, let's put a domestic animal somewhere here. Cool. Some food. I need more food. Rabbits. Gives more food if next to other rabbits. Okay, let's try it. Uh, I'll just have to put more rabbits out here. We need, we need 90 food. Wow. Lots of food. Hmm. Enough 86 almost crap. <laughs> Too bad I can't do this over here. How do I increase the food by just a little bit more? Nope, can't do that. Um grabbing some range. Upgrades mineral tech, which I don't need. Actually. Can I upgrade mineral tech on top of these things? No. So um, I already used my upgrade ability there for upgrading this crap. Um, I think I need to throw down a plant. Hate to do it, but I think I need a plant here. Alright, these guys are building custom house and they need lots and lots of uh, food and wealth. So we can build that. Next is for minerals within range. Okay, so let's go build more minerals. Because they need wealth. So I can build another mineral there. That'll increase the wealth a little bit. And up the food a little bit. If this expands a little bit more, it will be. Perfect, so. Uh, swamp Ambassador has appeared. Cool. So who needs a Swamp Ambassador? Desert Swamp. Let's go get... Um, this toxic aspect. I don't know if that's what I want, but that's what I'm getting. So it looks like I'm unlocking achievements. <laughs> uh, I think I will get the prosperity one. I have seven minutes remaining. Um, I don't know if I'll get three completed upgraded projects, but we'll see. Alright, so that's more minerals. Um, upgrades a plant with toxic aspect adds tech. So we'll do that later. Uh, adds food to the plant. Let's do that now. So I can get this upgrade. Cool. I have enough there. How are we doing over here? We're doing something over here. Um, wealth in use 18 out of 20. So I need more wealth. I need more technology and I need more food over here. So I need. Let's bring everybody. And we'll figure out what I'm doing once everybody's over there. Okay. So university's completed. We are upgraded there. University challenge started here. Everybody's happy. Prosperity is slowly increasing. Get to 600. Okay, we need food, wealth, and technology. So this I can upgrade the mineral there. That should be enough to cover my wealth needs. I can add another technology mineral here and upgrade that. That should cover my technology needs. I've got wealth covered, I've got technology covered, and food is close, but not quite where I need it to be. Um, this increases plant, this increases animals. Uh, can I upgrade my plants here? No, I cannot because they're already upgraded, so what I need is the forest giant to lay down some more plants. And I will upgrade the plants with a fruit aspect there. Give lots of food if they're close to animals. Let's see. Well, they give a little bit more food there. Then I can upgrade them a little bit more. 
I've been learning this, and that does me no good. Oh, now it does. 12. Sweet. Does that get me past the food? It does. Good. So I should be able to at least get that project completed. Now this one. Uh, let's move everybody over here, because it's the only way I know how to do things. And we'll figure out what to do. I need way more wealth. <clears throat> Activate symbiosis. Oh, let's probably uh, get next to plants. Okay, forest ambassador. So we got another forest ambassador. Uh, who could use a forest ambassador? Unlocks with a forest ambassador. Can I pick up a forest ambassador? Yes, I, I can. Maybe. Be another forest ambassador there. Um, uh, give more wealth next to plants. Okay. Otherwise, symbiosis. Um, it's another quartz. So I just need to build precious mineral. I just need to keep building quartz, and that will skyrocket my wealth. There we go. Ninety-nine. Upgrade that, and that should do it. Can't upgrade that, but I can upgrade one of these. Upgrade this one, upgrade that one. Be perfect. And I've reached 600 prosperity. All right, at least one achievement's done. Hoping to get the other ones. Come on, upgrade this. This guy's got two ambassadors, so he can upgrade minerals for wealth as well. And, ah, uh, well, I can't once these guys have already upgraded them. <clears throat> okay. So now we need to worry about 40 food. I don't want to build these guys. Um, guess food... They can graze on plants. Okay, maybe I will build something like that. So uh, let's build one of those guys here, and we'll build a plant here. So this way, this should increase, um, or maybe it won't, because it's wrong symbiosis, but that's okay. Uh, another forest ambassador. We can use a forest ambassador. Desert ambassador. This guy can use a forest ambassador. I'll pick up a forest ambassador. I can give animals wealth. And they're going to war. Cool. Can I muck bomb them? I can. Put a stop to that war. Uh, I think I might have killed all the animals too. <laughs> Oops. Uh, what did I want to do then? Plants. Fruit plant here. Let's try that again. Animal there. Upgrade the animal. Upgrade the plant. Turn you into a goat. Turn you into agave. Lots of food. Still not quite enough. On each patch with animal range that has a plant within animal range. Okay, I think I just need more agave. This produces wealth, this produces food, less sir, growth aspect. go. Alright, so that should be enough to finish this project. <clears throat> These guys are alright. They're a little pissed off. A little greedy. They've expanded too much too soon. Cannot be helped. Child labor plus 15 wealth and... <laughs> oh, can't be good. At the university of all places. Child labor at the university. 
Um, I just want you to upgrade the stuff so that I can move on with my life. Undev project harbor completed text. Hmm. I don't think that's supposed to be like that. I might have found a problem. Um, but that's okay. I'm not gonna judge. Customs house built. University is built. We have a university here. Everybody's happy. Over 700 prosperity. So I am hoping I can achieve some of these achievements. Come on, build the damn customs house. <coughs> so plus 30 wealth for each coyote, rattlesnake, and gray fox source within the border. Stacks up to two times, but I don't have any of those. I don't know how to make those yet. I guess those are the exotic animals. Let's start down an exotic animal out here just to see what happens. Uh, yeah, out here, exotic animal. See what we get. We get desert tortoise that I can upgrade to a rattlesnake with letter, lesser predator aspect, which I get from a desert thing. All right, where? What are these guys attacking? They're going to attack Redport, which is the desert town. That's fine. I think the game will be over before then. I just wanted to get this upgrade before that happens, and I should be able to do it any second now. Alright. And hell, I can even get the predator aspect, maybe. Oh. Well, everybody's going to sleep, so that's going to be the end of this. I hope I got most of these achievements. Uh, achievement currency. Wow. It looks like I unlocked a lot of achievements. Steam's popping up with a bunch of achievements, so... Um, I'm hoping that's what this means. And I have cities going to war, which was one of the achievements. Although, I don't know. We have fiscal military state finish an arrow with a village which has 200 prosperity and three war markers. Um, I don't know if that counts, but I think I only have one. No war markers. Hmm. I don't know how you get war markers. Well, it's not influenced by danger. Well, anyways, everyone's going to sleep. The era is going to end, and uh, I didn't even build on the whole planet, but that's okay, uh, because I hope I got enough achievements to unlock the 60-minute game, which will let me do more stuff, give me a lot more time to hopefully get even more achievements. Does this indicate war? Yeah. Oh, Desert Ambassador. Those are the potential Desert Ambassadors that are out there. So let's see what we've unlocked. Special Economy. Finish now with three upgraded projects. Finish now with 600 Prosperity. Level up. And fishing village. Five ocean pastures within its border. Cool. Um, so we'll finish game. Achievement unlock. Specialized economy. Post classical era. And level two. And the fishing village. Awesome. Finish game. So let's see what I've done. Uh, unlocks. Take a quick look here. So I have a few more to unlock in this level one. Fiscal military state, but now I can start working on these level twos. For example, finish an era with 800 prosperity. So I think I need way more time for all that. So luckily, I did unlock more time. I've unlocked more animals, which is kind of neat. And I'll be able to unlock even more animals later on. And I think I've unlocked more projects. I've unlocked all the level two projects here observatory, lighthouse, circus, bank, apothecary. And I haven't unlocked any level threes, but that's okay. Uh, so current level two, sweet. New game, so I can do a 60 minute era. And I can't do 120 minute yet, but I will be able to do a 60 minute era next time, and I'll probably do a two part video, splitting it into two halves, but this lets me play longer games, unlock more achievements, and that's kind of what this game is about. It's about, it's a god game, you build, you have fun, you enjoy yourself, but um, you also get unlocks, and that kind of makes the game interesting and lets you progress and so I will be playing this uh, just for a little bit more until I can unlock some more stuff and I'm still having fun if you guys are enjoying this series please uh, leave a like if you guys uh, have any suggestions for me if you've played the game before and you know uh, what I should be doing because I'm kind of <laughs> uh, 
playing through this somewhat blindly. I did read up on some stuff online, but didn't pay that much attention. So feel free to leave some comments below. And if you guys are enjoying my channel, please subscribe for more videos. I will be posting more in the near future. And with a subscription, you will get updates. So uh, yeah, that's that. I hope you guys uh, will keep on tuning in, and I'll see you next time.